Hi, RJ Spencer here, Conservation Director for Utah Department of Agriculture and Food. I want to give you a quick update on the COVID-19 relief grant. As many of you know, um, we did get funding through the CARES Act to help fund um, those that have losses due to COVID-19. We are closing applications November 9th um, at 5 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. So if you have an application out, um, you have not been funded or you haven't turned your application in, please do so. Um, we will have exhausted all of our funding and resources for this program um, by November 10th. So November 9th is when all applications will be due. Um, this is in order to meet the CARES Act and the federal regulations and the guidelines that have been given to um, the state of Utah and the Department of Agriculture. Um, all these funds must be authorized by December 1st, so please um, call us or contact um, the staff here at UDAF to ensure that your application is in and being processed. We know that this is a stressful time for everybody. Uh, we don't want to put a rush on everybody, but we are moving forward with this effect effect and these applications will be due November 9th. We want to get you the resources that you need to continue to do the things that you love, which is agriculture, and we appreciate that. Through the Conservation Division right now, we are always working hard to ensure that, um, that we can support producers in what they're doing, whether that be through the Water Optimization Grant, grants through the uh, Grazing Improvement Program, or one of our 38 conservation districts throughout the state of Utah. We are here to help you. We recently have hired three watershed coordinators in partnership with the Department of Water Quality um, in the Provo, Ogden, and Richfield areas. We've also hired four of our five positions in conservation district planners. Uh, this is in partnership with Natural Resource Conservation Service, or NRCS, um, in the Logan, Ogden, Provo, and Castleville area. We do have a position open in Roosevelt that will be posted on our website soon, so please be watching for that. As always, you can get your updates on our website at ag.utah.gov um, or follow us on one of our many social media sites. At this time, we encourage you to stay safe this wonderful Halloween. Stay masked and have a great day. Thanks.